Hey, welcome back. It wasn't a few minutes after last I turned it off. I might as well just leave this thing on, but um, I'm expecting uh, no adventures here. Anyways, uh, came up on a Ford Focus RS. It's yellow. Been doing about 100 uh, right now, and he's been uh, shadowing me, so. Um, yeah, I wish I would have the road to myself because I'd school some of these. Uh, some of these little fast and furious cars what a proper car is and I hate it because sometimes I'm driving vehicles that are not appropriate for me to provide an education to someone um, you know I can be in one of my service trucks which is a sprinter um, I can be in my GLE um, or whatever the case is and I got some little fast and furious kid or um, uh, you know, whatever, a Corvette, someone that thinks they're all Johnny Badass, and I just like, man, I wish I had my E right now, um, and, uh, you know, just, just have a little fun, just show them a little bit of a proper education, uh, but, um, but no, I would, uh, love more than nothing to just keep climbing here uh, on the speed and just see uh, how much this uh, little Ford Focus could uh, keep up with me. Um, I doubt it can do above 100, 150. Don't know anything about Fords, to be honest with you, but it is a little car, so um, I don't think it's has that capability. But it definitely would not be able to keep up with my E. That's for uh, that's for damn sure. Uh, there's not a lot of cars out there that's going to be able to even reach 170, much less uh, past that, uh, which. I've had my car up to about 193 or so, um, and I had to kind of back out of that because I ran out of road, but um, I think it will do every bit of 200. Um, gets a little dicey at that speed, obviously, um, and of course you got to have a lot of faith in your tires, uh, which I do run pro probably P-Zeros, and those things are perfectly balanced. Um, I do drive uh, the, the tire people crazy when I go there because it usually takes a few hours to to do my car. Um, yeah, they're just pretty finicky about it, but anyways. So yeah, um, this guy is uh, still behind me. I want to just push a little bit more and see how, how, how willing he is to, to go and go from there. So got a nice straightaway here. Um, Got a few cars in front of me and a truck and a trailer. Pretty good straightaway I can see. And um, I'll just uh, maybe do a call out here, see what happens. So as soon as this uh, truck with the nice looking Razor, uh, I'm in the ATVs off-roading. So uh, yeah, we'll wait for him to, to clear and we'll uh, see how fast we can go. See how much uh, Mr. Ford Focus wants to keep up and, and play. So I know Ken Block has a Ford Focus. Obviously, it's modified. Uh, definitely looks like a quite a capable rally car. But uh, but yeah, talking about amazing driver. Are you kidding me? He is. Uh, he's uh, he's pretty crazy. Um, but. Uh, yeah, I'm surprised they don't use him in movies uh, for stunts and stuff, but uh, everything nowadays seems to be freaking CGI crap, which drives me crazy. Um, I like the old school stuff, Smoking the Bandit, that sort of thing, Cannonball Run. All those, uh, all those old school where you're actually doing it in real life. Um, and, uh, yeah, I'm not saying all movies are like that, but most movies are. Okay, here we go take her up and see what happens. Coming up on a hill though, so I'm going to back off. Just can't see around that hill there. So 134.
like Mr. Ford, Ford Focus Man is is catching up now. I don't know if he was trying to keep up hardcore or not. Whatever. I'm just trying to make a name. 